Hello, I'm Joseph Vargo with SimplyMac.com, your premier Apple specialist. We have our headquarters in Salt Lake City, Utah with eight retail locations in Utah, Idaho, and Wyoming. I'm going to show you now how to lock the keyboard on an iPad. All right, so if we're going to use the keyboard, I'm going to go into Notes again here, and we'll do a new note, Rating Plus. Our keyboard automatically pops up. We can have the keyboard go away. If we tap this button in the right-hand corner, then the keyboard goes away. Uh, we can also um, split our keyboard. So if I take my two thumbs and slide them out, um, then I've got a keyboard that's split. And I can move that by holding this uh, up and down, um, moving it up or down, depending on where I want it. And then it stays in that spot. Uh, so that's kind of nice and convenient. Um, I can also hold down some buttons to get some different features. There's all the different I's. Um, you know, there's no R's or D's. I hold down the S and I get a lot of other options on S. So if you are interested in a feature that isn't shown, just hold down that key and it will give you the, the other one that you might want to see. Like the dollar sign could be changed to euros or yen or whatever else you want. So if your goal is to lock the keypad so that no one else can use it, uh, there's really uh, not a way to do that. The only way I would know how to trick it into doing that would be to connect a Bluetooth keyboard. Uh, and then this keyboard would, would go away. You wouldn't be able to see it and it would not pull up because it's connected to a keyboard that's on a table or a desk further away. Uh, and then when you turn that Bluetooth off or you bring the keyboard near it, then you could type on that keyboard instead. Again, I'm Joseph Vargo with SimplyMac.com and I showed you how to lock the keyboard on the iPad.